came to Hong Kong in 1978. My father was here previously, and uh, after many years, in 1991, I sponsored my family, my mom, my two brothers and sister in Hong Kong. Since then, since then I'm living in Hong Kong. From very beginning, I start with the normal job in office, or like a delivery boy, or later on van driver. Then today I become a businessman, and uh, all because of Hong Kong, I guess. So I treating Hong Kong, China, my country. I came here in 1976 as a businessman, and uh, I have registered my company, and then we started our business here, and we are still doing some business. Now we are living here with my two sons and their family, my family. I have changed my passport and become Hong Kong uh, SAR passport, uh, Hong Kong Chinese. So now I am Hong Kong Chinese and uh, uh, all my family is also. We love our country, Hong Kong and China. You know, this uh, used to be a army gas. British Army used to live here, this place, and they brought from subcontinent Muslims and other nationalities at that time. So uh, Muslims live here, so they wanted to have a place for worship. That in 1950, the land was granted, but the lease deed was made in 1850 uh, December for 1999 years lease. So this lease, at that time, our trustee signed to become the uh, management. Then we have uh, built this mosque. The first mosque was built in 1850. It was a, a temporary structure. Then when the population Muslim grows, then we rebuilt it and it was fully funded by a businessman from Bombay subcontinent. So present structure you see, this is built was 1915, inauguration was done by 15 August, by Muhammad Ilyas and uh, Ishaq Ilyas and this was time and on, we used to refurnish and make all these windows you see, this was later on in 1980s it was added. The first design was uh, Mr. Abdul Rahim, he is from uh, India, subcontinent. He designed the first structure. The, this was 70 feet long, 20 feet, uh, 40 feet width, and 20 feet high. Rules regulation is that as a Muslim, we have to observe the rules of uh, coming to, uh, to, pray, uh, to pray in the mosque. We have to take out our shoes outside. Then we come and pray as you see here. There are five times prayers. In the morning before sunrise. Then uh, afternoon uh, about one o'clock. Then uh, five o'clock. Then uh, sunset. Immediately after sunset. Then uh, two hours after uh, sunset. This is the last mosque. Uh, namaz. Muslims are, uh, you know, here now the population of Muslim grown, so they need masjid for prayer. So this is uh, centrally located. So people who are working nearby in offices, they come here for prayer. You're not allowed to eat inside the. Uh, mosque. Inside, no drinking, no eating. No eating. Not allowed. Of course, pork. Uh, Muslim cannot eat pork. It's forbidden for us. We have to face through. That side, maybe to have we have to face uh, Kaaba. Kaaba when we pray. Direction of Kaaba. Our, our direction has to be to the Makkah. So this mosque, we have you know we have domes in the Islamic way, and uh, that place is towards Makkah. So we have to face that way when we pray five times a day, or we have other prayers. The construction of this minarets, you know, this is the Islamic structure uh, to have dome. To have minarets, yeah. so this is the uh, culture of Islamic culture. All over the world, you will find these things. All the mosques similar like this.
Cantonese. Both. Both stars. Uh, chicken tikka. Uh, double tea. Traditional. Carry lamb. Carry lamb. Chingming. Chinese New Year. Tao. Buddhist, Christian, six. We want Hong Kong that it should be a peaceful place and there should be no discrimination. All people together, ethnic minority and Chinese people are one, one community. And we want to improve this uh, image that Hong Kong is a uh, international city. Uh, first of all, uh, it's very much clear that Hong Kong is my home. And uh, I'm here from last 40 years. My family, we are here, we love Hong Kong. And why? Because uh, uh, in Hong Kong, we have uh, stability. Uh, you know, uh, people are law-abiding citizens. We have good uh, safety for each and every person in Hong Kong. 